Hello there, Libra. Um, Grandma Rose, Grandma Dorothy, and Alma, please come into the space. May all the angels and saints, Archangel Metatron, Archangel Michael, Archangel Gabriel. Okay, we got we got a woman teaching a kid again, and I think this is a seven of pentacles. Yeah, it is. And we got a, do you know what I see on this? I see people setting up a Christmas tree for Christmas together with the tunes, the jams, baby. We got the whole freaking package. Am I right? Oh, I'm right. That's what I see on this card. I also see a teacher teaching someone with a young spirit some wise information. Please clarify this, Holy Spirit. Please clarify the Seven of Pentacles. Whoa, we got a celebration. I don't know what's better than setting up a Christmas tree with your boo, with your divine masculine Libras. This is what's ahead. We got celebration and we got the lovers. Um, is this coming together, Holy Spirit? The lovers um, setting up the Christmas tree. We got a Knight of Cups on the top, Holy Spirit. May only the truth come out. Yes! We got celebration again. We got a queen of pentacles just holding her abundance, just waiting to give. We got spying energy. Her DM is almost evervescently present. Oh, yes, he is. He's got her back like ride or die. I'm not even going to lie. They're the lovers. I mean, it can't get any more clear than this. Holy Spirit can't get any more clear. Hard at work to make this all come into fruition. Yeah, he is. Yeah. Um, let's get some clarification. So, um, how is the DM feeling about this? The Christmas tree decorations. He's like, I can't wait for my Catholic queen. <laughs> all secrets exposed and out. We got a divine counterpart. Okay. Really, this is just heading in all the right direction. So, Holy Spirit, come into every part of us, even the places we've kept it in. We want to live a life that honors you. So just direct or guide our thinking. Give us the words to speak, Lord. Give us the words to speak. Oh, may our mind and tongue just be ever present and make us thy true apostle. Oh my gosh, we're totally going to do a communion together over here. Okay, we're going to do this for everyone, so this is what we do. So, I'm putting on my, this is my turbo glove, because I like to keep my hands clean, because clean hands, clean heart. I love to wash my hands a lot, too, just to keep my heart super clean, make sure it's purified. Also, Epsom salt baths to get all those spirits from the world out of you, so... In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Jesus, intercede the body of Christ for my love. Mm. In the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, may this body of Christ intercede sky, sky, in Jesus Christ. Mm. Body of Christ for future children. For my Libras. And then for all my viewers. In the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, Body of Christ. I am one for good luck. Mmm. Delicioso. Mmm. And then, I have just the tiniest drop. Blood of Christ for everyone I've just announced. Mmm, delicioso. Okay, amazing. Let's get back to the reading. So, Lord, let's have a clarification on the Christmas tree decorations. Please open your word up to us. I mean, open us up to your word. In Jesus' name, amen. Yeah! Okay. Our true spiritual condition is evident not so much by our, our religious activities as it is by what we depend on for 
for security. In Luke 18, 18, 23, Jesus exposed a wealthy young man's dependence on his possessions. Jesus brought him face to face with a common human problem, misplaced devotion. We don't know whether or not this young man ever repented for his attachment to his belongings, but each of us is faced with the same choice. Only by renouncing our unhealthy dependencies can we receive the lasting spiritual treasure, a healthy, fulfilling relationship with God, ourselves, and others. So I think one of the most crucial things about how Jesus is my rock, and that's how I roll. Thanks, China Phillips, for that. She baptized me in the bathtub. It was pretty special. <laughs> um, any who's all, she's a homie. It's really important that we have a string attached from us to the heavens. <coughs> oh, gee, the hot turbo. Hot turbo alert. Um, as our rock, and also what I get from that is like my my I surrender prayer. Like, Lord, like please. I surrender. We realize we've been putting so many things above you. Infatuation, image, toxicity. Guide us back to you and your light. Nothing is more fulfilling than the light of the Lord. If that comes first, everything else follows. Everything else snowballs. So that's beautiful. Thank you so much, Libras. This was a beautiful reading. Mwah. Blessings. And may my Libras and any viewers that watch this have the most best, blessed, blessed, best day ever and may they seek you in everything they do and may they not let that string dissipate may they keep that liminal space tied tightly to you as their rock lord in jesus name amen Mwah.